I was late today because um, some strawberries got run over on the freeway. What? Well, it created a traffic jam. <sighs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex with Corbin. Jam! Get it? You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks for your page for follow us on the like button. Today, we got a uh, new Malayalam trailer that just dropped. I bet it's going to be original, creative, and wonderful. Yeah, it's called, it's, uh, I think we've heard stuff about it. It's the, say it right here. It's Mamanan. It's uh, directed by Mari. Which is a little thing of bread you give to your mother. It's directed by Mamanan. Mari what? Right here. Uh, Mari Silverage. It's A.R. Rahman, a uh, non hey, of ours. We know that guy. <laughs> and it has, um, read these, lead cast. Lead cast, forgive mispronunciations. Um, Udhayanid Stalin, Vidivelu, uh, a lesser known actor by the name of Fahad Fasil, uh, Kirthi Surich. Yeah. Uh, so it's a, a new Fafa film. A uh, highly anticipated uh, film. A lot of people looking forward to this one uh, from what I hear. Uh, let's just get into it. Don't know anything about it. Awesome. Okay, here we go. We think. <coughs> here we go. That's definitely Aaron Ramon. trailer oh Malayalam industry how I love you so <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was awesome yeah uh, it looked like it's probably gonna be in a pretty intense film uh, like uh, I don't know if it's full-on gangster but it was given yeah. those vibes it was uh, politics gangster something 
and then a lot of it's Malayalam, so they're not going to give you no. all of what's actually going on. No, 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 and lots of symbolism, obviously. Um, um, the way I didn't mention this in the review of yeah. Ballad of Brawls, yeah. but seeing the subtitles the way they were at the very beginning, my thought was, whoa, was that Netflix? Because apparently there is a huge uproar over Netflix doing another crappy thing. Hmm. Um, they just took it upon themselves to change subtitles after the creators of the film had subtitled the films themselves. This is the power Netflix feels they can wield now over the creators. Not only do they keep your creative content so that when it's off their platform, no one, including you, can see it, but they'll just change the words of your subtitles, and then when you ask for an explanation, they won't say anything because I guess they're not they're too big to be accountable for anything anymore. Oh, that's infuriating. Okay, read this for me. The community that was exploited by the town's influential man, who completely rules due to the powerful backing of the authorities. A man collects evidence to flip him upside down when he was helpless to stop his endless torture. So it's a revenge story, too. Uh, so it's the director. Yeah, the poster is that was a powerful image there when they're sitting there waiting for them to come in. Uh, so the, it's the director of Carnan, uh, which is the, the Danush film, which had actually really brilliant um, cinematography in it. Um, in that one and then another film of his that a lot of people i've heard a lot about is mm -hmm. uh, say it pariyuram Pudamal. we haven't seen it we haven't seen it but we know about. of it um the visuals looked great um so that that's that's really really good uh fafa looked in his fafa element uh <laughs> which you know is just acting yeah that's his element um but this looked like Something that he can really sink his teeth into, mm -hmm. uh, which is wonderful. This looked AR, the, the score behind it so far looks. You know, that's going to be good. Going to be absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Uh, my curiosity would be as if we are going to get it. It bodes well that you have the name AR Rayman attached to it along with Fafa. Yeah, but he does so much. He does so much. Um, my suspicion is it's going to be an hour and a half away from here. If, if it gets distribution in, in the States. I hope it gets distribution. I do States. too. I do um, too. If not, if anybody's involved. Who's the production company? Uh, Red Giant Movies. Oh, the distributor's Netflix, so it's going to go to their platform. <laughs> it won't get a theatrical release. No, it is. It said it's getting a theatrical release. In India? No, we've... No, that... that, that I, don't, I don't think... That happens all the time. So, like, the movie I just watched, the... Um, Probus one, right? Mm -hmm. That it's already contracted with Amazon, and so it's going to well, Amazon in eight weeks. So this is probably already contracted with Netflix, right? To go on there uh, in whatever, however long it's in, it's going to be in theaters. So it's it that that's a normal thing that happens. They get the distri the the streaming rights before it comes out. Yeah, of course. For however long their theatrical in india it's really short windows mm -hmm. uh, it's like sometimes a month or yeah and then yeah they'll go on to the thing but um i'm my hope is that we would my Me bet too. is that we'll it'll be much farther down yeah um it also what sometimes does happen is if it does really well then they will redistribute it a week or two after it's come out yeah to more theaters yeah uh, and so that's how, like, uh, I was able to see the 2018 movie. Mm -hmm. It wasn't distributed here. Mm. And then it was doing very well. Doing very well, and, and they, so they gave it a larger gave distribution. It a larger distribution, and it came to a movie that wasn't really a uh, theater that's not close, but it's not as far as where we saw the LJP. No, film. and screens are going to get filled up big time here because you've got Indiana Jones Flash in the next it. in the next few weeks. Flash, Flash is, is there right now. Yeah. Indiana Jones is coming. Spider-Man's still there. Spider-Man anyway. is still there and is going to stay there a while. Uh, the Indiana Jones film, Top Gun. Dead Reckoning is coming out. Yeah. Uh, Barbie, Barbie, and Oppenheimer. then Oppenheimer. So yeah. theaters, screens are going to have limited availability for anything other than... Blockbuster we are in right now. It's, the summer is blockbuster mode. It's a big... It feels like a big summer, too. It does. It is a big... It's the first really big, big summer with multiple big releases, I think, since we've gotten out of COVID. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, anyways, that looked great. Uh, let us know what you thought about it. Uh, if you are excited for it, and anything else we need to know down below. Just